Uh, I can't be living off checks. Burn the sets when I'm stressed. EPE what I rap. In the ground shit. Yeah, yeah, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Chosen One with two guns repping that EMZ Bitch TV. First thing first, man, make sure you smash that sub button. Like, share, comment, all the above, all that good stuff. Now, check it, check it, check it. Today, Goofy of the Day goes to uh, NFL player that goes by the name of Eric Reed and everybody else who's going against Jay-Z for being par owner of an NFL team. Par owner, not full owner, but par owner. Now, Eric Reed, right, blasting Jay-Z. Well, first of all, I'm going to just read to y'all what he said. I got it right here. So every, they went to the locker room after a game and they asked him what this what does he think about Jay-Z trying to buy a team for ownership. He goes and says this. Jay-Z claimed to be a supporter of Colin, wore his jersey, told people not to perform at the Super Bowl because of the treatment that the NFL did to Colin. And now he's going to be part owner. It's kind of despicable. He told reporters inside the locker room. And then he also said a whole lot of other stuff, but I'm not going to go into all of that first of all jay-z is his own man jay-z got a family you feel me jay-z is not a follower you know what i'm saying jay-z never been a follower jay-z is a trendsetter you know what i mean people do a lot of stuff today to this day because of jay-z from what he did back in the day you know what I'm saying? I know people that wear do-rags because Jay-Z made it famous to wear a do-rag back when he did uh, his first two albums. You feel me? It's a lot of stuff. People just don't like to admit it. But anyway, but besides that, right, Jay-Z being part owner of an NFL team doesn't make him a bad guy by, by no means. I don't see... People, you know why people are mad? They mad because they can't do what he does. That's what it is. At the end of the day, this is all goes down to jealousy. Everybody's looking at Jay Z. He's just getting more richer and more richer and more richer. He's buying stuff. He's he buying everything. You know what I'm saying? He bought Ace of Spades. You know what I'm saying? And he got he he just got Dream Chaser, the label under Rock Nation. He's doing like a million things, and he just keep winning and winning and winning. Jay Z haven't took a L since i don't know when you know what i'm saying i i i don't know when jay-z ever took a l you know what i mean jay-z only to gets w's he only wins and wins and wins this boils down to jealousy people are jealous you feel me nobody ever thought about being part owner of a nfl team you feel me eric reed why are you so mad at jay talking about that he shouldn't be doing this then why you play football then if you feel so bad uh, if, if if you if you feel so bad about what's going on in, in the NFL, then quit. Then quit, bro. Go 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 play tennis or something. You feel me? Go play golf. Go 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 do another sport. Go go somewhere else where they treat you better. Then why are you still playing football? If it's that bad, why are you still playing football? Oh, I know why. Because you got a family too, right? You need money too, right? Well, guess what? Jay Z also needs money too. Yeah. He needs money. What do you think? You think Jay-Z got to the point that where he's at right now? By 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 what? By following us, by, by, by following people and, 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 and not doing creating his own lane. Jay-Z creates his own lane and he does what he wants. Jay-Z for president. I'm pushing Jay-Z for president. I'm doing videos by putting Jay-Z for president. You feel me? I feel like he's the only one in in, in the music industry. That might actually get to become a president. Because, look, I never would have thought that um, that any that somebody with just the right amount of money can become a president. Donald Trump proved that. Donald Trump, you know what I'm saying? He, 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 proved, he proved that having money can actually... You, you can actually become a president having the right amount of money. Because Donald Trump don't know nothing about presidency. He didn't know nothing about nothing. But he had the money. He had the money. And he's white. And he had, why he had damn near 90, 
like 97% of white America vote for him. You know what I'm saying? Like at least 97%. I know, I know a bunch of black people that voted for him. You know what I'm saying? I know a bunch of Cubans that voted for Trump. You know what I mean? But this ain't about Trump. This is about Jay-Z. Jay-Z is his own man. You feel me? Y'all need to just stop hating, bro. Stop hating. Make make your money, bro. If you if you out there, if you making money, you won't have to hate on the next man. You know what I'm saying? He's just a part owner of an NFL team. A part owner. That doesn't mean that he owns the NFL. He can't ever own the whole NFL. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I don't even know if that's possible. He is just a part owner of a team, a part owner. You know what I'm saying? Which means that he can't, the only thing that he can really do is whatever I heard is the 49ers. This, but I'm only hearing this from WAC 100. So don't quote me on that yet. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to WAC 100 because WAC 100 understands what Jay Z is doing and he's respect. He's like, Jay Z's the man, he should run for president. You feel me? Jay-Z is just going to be a part owner of a team. Whatever team that is, that means he's going to be able to help whoever's in that team, being black, Hispanic, or whatever race you are. He's going to be able to help just like he helps a lot of people. Why do you think so many rappers rock with Jay-Z? You know what I'm saying? 21 Savage, uh, uh, Meek Mills, um, Nipsey Hussle. Uh, Rick Ross uh, Casanova You know what I'm saying Like why you think so many people rock with him If Jay-Z was really a bad person If he was really out here just using people And and you know what I'm saying Just really using people And be, and getting rich off of them A lot of people wouldn't be rocking with Jay They'd be like nah man That, that dude man That dude ain't about nothing man He don't care about us He don't care about us He just cares about making money you know what I'm saying? Do you do you know that Tadal? Do you know that Tadal pays the most money out of all social media outlets? Tadal pays more than Spotify. Tadal pays more than uh, iTunes. I yeah, what is it? iTunes? Yeah, iTunes. They pay more than iTunes. They pay more than Spotify, and and what whatever. What whatever um whatever website that people go to to distribute their music that they make money off of, nobody is messing with Tidal when it comes to that. Tidal gives you the most money for your work and music. So how does that sound? To me, that sounds like he's helping. He's helping the whole industry because you're making more money with the with him than anything else. Oh, there you go in YouTube also. You will never make as much money anywhere else than you will in Tadal. Signing to Jay-Z and Tadal. You feel me? Why you think so many rappers went to Tadal? Nicki Minaj, uh, Rihanna, Taylor Swift. Like all types of people. Not even rappers. You got pop artists. You got rock and roll people. You got thousands of people went to Tadal because Tadal pays the most. Why wouldn't you go to somewhere that pays the most? You know what I'm saying? Do you know how hard that is for somebody to do something like that? You know you know what type of hustle is that is? And stuff like that is what gets people mad. Talking about Jay-Z never kneel. Jay-Z, I never seen Jay-Z kneel. Jay-Z doesn't have to kneel. He doesn't have to do everything that you do. You feel me? Jay-Z is not no follower, man. He's in his own lane. He created his own lane. Jay-Z is not over here following people. Oh, you took a knee? Let me take a knee. Jay-Z don't play football. Talking about, I never seen Jay-Z. The Jay-Z play, play for the Dallas Cowboys? Nah, bro, Jay-Z ain't no quarterback. You feel me? He's, he's a rapper that uh, 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 happens to be an entrepreneur that just made his first billion. He is a billionaire now. You feel me? Soon he's going to be a trillionaire. Before Jay-Z died, he's going to be a trillionaire. He's not stopping. You think a billion is going to stop him? He's not stopping. Before Jay-Z dies, he's going to be a trillionaire. I'm telling you. Jay-Z is going to create something that's going to be so amazing that people ain't going to have no choice but to sign to him. Because you're going to make so much money that you will be a dummy 
to not sign to him. You understand? You feel me? So this is for all the people that are just bashing Jay-Z. Come on, bro. He's just a par owner of an NFL team. A par owner. And y'all bashing him for that? Like he really out there in the field catching the football, running, run, running to the touchdown. You know what I mean? Receiving the punt. You know what I mean? Like, come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? He's just a par owner. It's not that serious. But to y'all it's serious because it's the jealousy, it's the hate, it's the envy, hate that's in people's heart. Damn, this guy just became a billionaire. He Now he's buying an NFL team. Oh my God, I'm sick to my stomach. Blah, blah. Y'all over there throwing up. Y'all so sick, y'all over there throwing up. Why don't you go make your own moves, bruh? Why don't you go do your own hustle, bruh? Why don't you do that? Over here bashing Jay-Z. And stuff like that. Talking about he never kneeled. Jay Z Jay Z don't play football. You feel me? If he wants to if he wants to own half of a team, he could do that. He could do whatever he want, bro. This is the land of the free, right? Just because he does that, that doesn't mean that he's against his people. You know what I'm saying? He just helped Meek Mill with his dream chaser uh label. You feel me? When you you think that Meek Mill didn't read that whole contract that he didn't get a lawyer to read that and tell him this is the best move that you're ever gonna make by doing this with Jay-Z and Meek Mill is a street guy Meek Mill is a street and he ain't no dummy you feel me Jay-Z was that bad of a person Meek you think Meek will be signing all of them contracts having a label under his label do you know what type of a move that is him doing a move like that means that he's going to be making a lot of millions in the future. Then he's going to be able to take care of his family a hundred thousand years even after he's dead. Dream Chasers will still be out there. You know, his great, 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 great grandkids will still be eating off of Dream Chasers. Like, that's where Jay-Z is at. Jay-Z's mind is into the future. While y'all thinking about today, Jay-Z is 20 years ahead of y'all. You feel me? This move that Jay-Z is doing with the NFL, this is not for today. This is for 20 years from now. He's doing this to get closer to something else. Whatever that is, I don't know. But soon, you will know. You feel me? Everything that Jay-Z does... It's a power move. You feel me? It's a move behind everything that this is not random. Jay Z just didn't wake up one morning and say, "You know what? Uh, let me go be part owner of an NFL team." You know what I'm saying? Because I'm just bored. Let me go just make a few more millions off of Jay Z. Don't move. everything that he does is a calculated move. You know what I'm saying? All y'all talking, y'all just goofies, bro. It's a whole, it's a whole goof troop. It's a group goof troop of y'all out there bashing Jay Z because he's being a part owner. Now that y'all bashing him, y'all will never be able to work with him. Y'all will never be able to be nowhere near him because of your feelings for having girly emotional feelings. You know what I'm saying? Kaepernick, uh, wife talking bad about him too. You feel me? Okay, because Jay Z might have told people, okay, don't perform at the at, at the Super Bowl. All right, but that's something different though. That's way different. He's just being part owner of a NFL team. You feel me? That doesn't mean that that he's that that he's owning the whole NFL and even if he did that would be a good move because then he could be able to bring people like uh, Kaepernick into back into the field he could be able to help all the people that was kneeling you know what I'm saying maybe by him being a part owner of this team he can get closer to the big people that's behind in the NFL office I'm talking about the real big people he could get next to them and he could get into the ear and be like look man you can't be doing this and this and this and that and things will get better you know what I'm saying but people are not thinking about that what people are thinking about is the money that's what people heart is at and that's what they're thinking about it's all about the money 
and that's the, that's where the jealousy and the envy come from because these people they're not making no money they ain't making no money and they mad as hell that they're not making no money and Jay Z over here buying everything that's walk that walks everything you feel me there's nothing wrong with that I don't see nothing wrong with that you know what I'm saying Jay Z is not performing at no Super Bowl all he did was buy but being part of an NFL team just part he's not even owning the whole thing and even if he did own the whole thing let's say the 49ers even if he did bought the whole 49ers that's still a good move because he could be able to help out a lot of players he could be able to sign players you know what I'm saying he sees something in you oh here's 25 million for three years you a rookie I give you 25 million right now. You come to my team and you'll be on the Rock Nation. You'll get certain deals and stuff and all of this for being down with me. And on top of that, you'll have connects to every to a lot of people that he knows and stuff like that. But see, people don't see the bigger picture. What people are seeing is, oh, Jay-Z is only doing it for the money. He's only doing it for the money. When you hear people talking about he's only doing it for the money, they're mad because they ain't got no money. If I, I pay attention, pay attention, and look at the people that are talking about Jay Z. Look at the ones that are talking about Jay Z. Look where their money is at. There's nowhere near Jay Z. I mean, just look and pay attention to the ones who are talking bad about Jay Z. And you could tell that these are people that are going through stuff. Wack 100 said nothing but good stuff about Jay Z. Well, Wack 100 makes money. He's good. He's a good hustler. He's making a ton of money off of Blueface. You feel me? He's making so much money off of Blueface that if Blueface was to find out how much money he's making off of him, Blueface would throw up right now. If he was to find out how much, but it's okay because Blueface wouldn't be nobody anyway. So you can't get mad. You feel me? This is. This is my point. You can't. People are too jealous in this world. Y'all got too much hate in your heart over the next man for having more money than you and for doing stuff that you never thought of. You feel me? This is a sick world, man. We live in a sick world. We live in a world where there's too much jealousy, there's too much envy, man. People get killed every day for this, man. Triple X got killed for fifty thousand dollars, bro. You know what I'm saying? Envy, jealousy. Why this guy has to have so much money and we out here broke? They couldn't even just take his money. They had to murk him because they wanted to make sure he never made a penny. You know what I'm saying? That's just an example. There's so much sick people, uh, jealous people. Just jealousy is a mug. Jealousy is a mug, man. You know what I mean? People just can't stand seeing another man win. They just can't stand it. They just can't. It makes them sick, man. It makes people sick. Oh, Jay-Z, Jay-Z, this, Jay-Z, that. He's only doing it for the money. He only doing it for the money. Like if you yourself wouldn't want to own half of the 49ers. And again, I'm only saying 49 is because of Wack 100 said that. It's not 100%. Uh, it's not. A, it's not. A, it, you don't quote me on that yet. You feel me? It's not. It's not known what team he's trying to be part owner of. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, man. You know what I mean? It's just a lot. At the end of the day, this boils down to hate. Jay Z. Jay Z never was in the NFL. Jay Z doesn't have to kneel down. Why would Jay Z have to kneel down if he never played in the NFL? Why would why would you want Jay Z to kneel down? Why? Because you say so. You want Jay Z to kneel down a man that already accomplished so much stuff in his life. You don't think Jay Z went through racism in the beginning? You don't think that Jay Z went through a whole bunch of trials and tribulations to get to where he's at right now? You know what I'm saying? Jay Z had Rock Rockefeller. They broke down. It was three of them. They all split their money and they all went their ways. Why is it that Jay Z is the only one on top? Why? Because Jay Z knows how what he's doing. He's the one with he's he's the one with the brains. Dame Dash had the same amount of money Jay Z had when they split up. 
Why Dame Dash don't got the same money as Jay-Z? Why does Kareem Big don't have the same money as Jay-Z? Because Jay-Z is 20 years, you know what I'm saying? 20 years in front of in front of everybody. While people thinking about today, Jay-Z is 20 years. You know what I'm saying? 20 years, 20 years over. You know, 20, 30 years in the future. Jay-Z don't think about today. He think about the future. This is the problem with people. A lot of people, they don't think about the future. They only go by today. Oh, how much money can I make today? No, well, look, look, look. If you buy this company, you can have $100 million in 10 years. What? I don't want that. But if you rank this, then you can make $2 million within six months. People rather take the $2 million in six months than to have $10, $20 million in 10 years and plus have even more money building up. And that's just an example. It really be more money than that. You feel me? That's just a little example. But that's the problem that we have nowadays. So this is why I'm giving all of y'all goofies the goofy of the day. Goof troop. Y'all hating on Jay-Z for being a part on. Y'all really mad, too. Y'all big mad. Y'all looking like little bitches, bruh. Straight bitches out here, bro. Talking about this man. He's just a part owner of the NFL team. Talking about, I never seen him kneel. You kneel, bro. You the one that's in the NFL. You the one that wanted to kneel. Jay-Z, when they asked him about the kneeling thing, what Jay-Z said? Jay-Z said, well... I think we're beyond this kneeling thing. Like, okay, like we, you know, they did the kneeling thing in the beginning to make a point, to prove a point about the about the NFL. Now, what do we do from? Where do we go from now? And it's true. Which 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 y'all what y'all want to do? Y'all want people to kneel every every game now? So then your bag could get messed up. Because at the end of the day, you kneeling is messing up your bag. Don't you got a family? You got to take care of your family at the end of the day. Racism is going to be around no matter what. What? So you rather take in your pride and let your family starve? Is that what you're telling me? Because no matter what, at the end of the day, you're going to end up working for a white man at the end of the day. Until you do what Jay-Z does and get your own company. You know what I'm saying? But in the beginning, you have to work for a white man in the beginning. Get your bread up, and then you go buy your own company, and you don't have to worry about kneeling with your hanging ass. Talking about Jay-Z never kneel. Jay-Z don't play football. Jay-Z's a damn rapper, entrepreneur, bro. Jay-Z don't have to get down on his knees. You get down on your knees, bro. If you feel like you got to, you get down on your knees. Now what? Now you mad. Now your kids are starving. You feel me? You can't even get signed. You you on the bench now because you want to follow a uh, Kaepernick. You know what I'm saying? What good have that really done you? Now you over here salty now. Now you over here getting mad at Jay Z. That's where I got you because you want to kneel. Okay, I understand. I understand the kneeling point. I understand that. But Kaepernick did that. Yeah, you you decided to follow Kaepernick because you are a follower. You're not a trendsetter. Kaepernick did the kneeling thing. That was good enough. You feel me? Why did you have to go follow him? Because you were a follower. You wanted attention. Now what? I can't get I can't get no money nowhere. I can't do this. He's like a little bitch. Put your money up and get and get busy, man. Put your money up and get busy, bro. You feel me? Like Jay Z does. Great hole. Whole running for president, man. That's about to be my new campaign. Whole running for president, bro. Stop acting like little bitches out there, man. And get to the bag. He's just a part owner of one team, bro. And even if he did own the whole team, even if he did own the whole NFL, y'all would still be mad, bro. Little bitches out here, man. Going against the whole because he part owner, bro. That just had me so tight, bro. So I'm giving all of y'all goofies of the day. Anybody who said anything negative about Jay Z for doing this move, all y'all goofies. All of y'all. I can't put the pictures of all of y'all on the cover art. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to put Eric Reed, big picture of him on the cover art with the goofy. You feel me? And then when y'all watch this video, y'all gonna see. But he's gonna be the main one because he the one that had the most to say. You know what I'm saying? And with that, I'm gone.
gang. Yeah, what up, what up, what up, what up? Hope y'all like the video. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, smash that like button, and drop some comments. Also, for those who want to show love and support to EMZ TV, just cash app, PayPal, and Venmo located in the description box in every video. Chosen one, two guns, EMZ, don't forget the TV, 100.